First video of the day. Let's stop stalling. Lock in here, chat. Kid fakes dying to skip school. Does he get caught? Somebody said Dr. Pepper Monkey Baby. What? Oh, look. It's the new kid. Yeah. Why aren't you in middle school? Because he tested straight into 11th grade. Yeah, I'm skipping 9th and 10th. Skipping 9th? Is that a thing people actually do? Like, you see that in, like, fucking young Sheldon and all those other cringe-ass sh- I fu Yo, can I just- Do y'all like the show Young Sheldon? It pisses me off. I hate it. Because I hated Big Bang Theory. I, like- Oh, my God. Okay, there's, like- I'm not gonna sit here and say I hated Big Bang Theory. There's a few okay episodes of Big Bang Theory, but the majority of Big Bang Theory is, like, let's make socially awkward jokes just off of the fact that they're socially awkward and it's funny that they're nerds and socially awkward. That's, like, the entirety of the show. And then Young Sheldon is that times three because it's just like, hey, we're gonna make this 10-year-old be a college student and also be a self-absorbed kid that thinks he's the fucking king of the world. I fucking hate young Sheldon. I fucking hate young Sheldon. It pisses me off. Ninth and 10th grade? Does that mean you're gonna go to class with us? What are you, some- I he I've heard of people in real life skipping classes, but it's normally like they'll skip one grade in like third grade. Like you don't usually skip the first two years of high school. You usually like all ret, you skip like third or fourth grade. And then so you're all like two years younger than your classmates when you're in fifth grade. And so, yeah, you're younger when you're like freshman, sophomore, junior, senior, but you're not skipping then because that's when like you actually have to fucking try. So they just make you try earlier. Sort of progeny? The words prodigy. <laughs> the yeah. words prodigy, boy. They just shove him in a locker. They just actually fucking kill him right here. And he's going off to college next year. What's the point of being in high school if you're just going to fucking be, you're going to be in high school for one year and then you're going to skip everything? Unless you flunk out. <laughs> Sick burn, dude. <laughs> Man, those guys are rude. Don't worry. They're like that to everyone. Mia! Andrew, there you are. I'm so glad you're going to Rebel High with me. Yeah, but Rebel I'm High? <laughs> oh, we're going to Rebel High together? In ninth grade, and you're able to start in 11th. My mom's making me do it, because that's what my brother did. Well, I just wish you were in class with me. Tell me about it. Oh, better go. Hey, Andrew. How was your first day at Rebel High? I Why is it that really smart kids are usually socially awkward? I've never thought about that. Like, what's... Is it because they're focusing most of their time on, like, learning rather than... Somebody said autism. I mean, yeah, in some cases, yeah. That would just be, like, some people that are very smart and also socially uh, awkward because they're autistic. But I mean, realistically, not every genius is also autistic, right? Like, a lot are, yeah. But I'm saying, like, j just because you're really smart doesn't mean you are therefore socially awkward or socially awkward because you're autistic. I'm saying, why are more smart, why are smarter people always tend to be more awkward? I'd rather be in ninth grade with all my friends. You should be happy you're in 11th grade. You'll graduate college before your friends even get out of high school. That's what you said when I skipped sixth grade. Can't I just play baseball, Roblox, and summer camp like my friends? Can I play baseball, Roblox, and summer camp? Uh, yeah, I don't know about this kid fucking skipping grades. Can I play summer camp? What are you talking about? You did summer camp last year. Mom- Who the fuck goes to summer camp? How, who here has ever been to a fucking go-away summer camp? Uh, not me. I feel like one out of every ten fucking people go to summer camp. Uh, that's like a shit in the fucking Disney movies. You guys go to summer camp? What do you even do? Sleep in a fucking cabin? Math camp doesn't count. It's so fun. What do you do? Can't I just be in ninth grade? Now, Andrew... Your brother graduated early, and you can too. 
After all, that's what your grandpa expects. You know that grandson of yours ain't going to amount to anything. <laughs> Andrew's your grandson too. If only he was like the other one who skipped high school and went straight to Dale University. <laughs> Bro, where did they get this man? Where did they get this man to act in this? Holy fucking shit. If only he went to Dale University. I was reading off a prompter. You mean your other grandson, Timothy? Yeah, that's why I'm paying for his college. Because he's a real go-getter. You know, every kid is different. If they've skipped four grades, they're not paying for their college. If, if you're entering college at 15, you have a full fucking ride. Like, what? They're acting like he has to pay for, like he has no scholarship, but he's in, he's in college when he should be like a freshman in high school. Why does she let Andrew just be himself? Fine. He can slack off if he wants. But I'm not paying for college. You mean Grandpa? Dale University this and Dale University that. He's so old and confused. I don't think he even yeah, knows- Grandpa doesn't even know how to fucking eat his food anymore. That old fuck. He got lost in a Walmart the other day. He just started taking a shit on the floor. He's telling me I have to go to Dale University. But he took a dump in one of the demo toilets in Home Depot. Knows where I go to school. That is no way to talk about your grandpa. He is willing to pay your way through college, and if you don't get in soon, it may never happen. Oh, you think he might be taking a dirt nap if I take too long? Andrew, that is a not- A dirt nap? Nah, I'm about to start referring to fucking death as that. <laughs> I'm about to take a dirt nap. <laughs> you're talking to your friend. You're like, yeah, I don't know how much, I don't know how much longer my grandpa's got before he takes a dirt nap. <laughs> what does that mean? Uh, when he fucking dies. We just don't want to waste your potential on a lot of high school. Andrew's grandpa will only pay for college if he graduates early, but he just wants to stay in ninth grade. Oh, hey, Mia. Andrew, I wanted to. Bro, he just wants to stay in ninth grade. Maybe fucking figure your shit out and get a bag, buddy. No money spread, head ass. Fucking dumbass said, oh, oh, can I, can I not make money for longer? Uh, that's not a grind mentality, loser. Oh, can I, can I stay, can I stay in high school longer and be broke? You fucking brokey. Oh my God, maybe get a fucking money spread. Maybe put in the hours, pal. I didn't know if you could come to my birthday party. Oh yeah, sounds like fun. When is it? It's Saturday. Oh, no can do. I've got scouting on Saturday. Not this Saturday. When's your party? Uh, Saturday. Oh, no can do. I feel like Saturday's the one day that people are free. What other day would you be open to have a party? Okay. Saturday the 15th, silly. Perf oh, no can do. I have scouting again. Perfect. I'll put it on my agenda. Okay, oh, my God. house. 11 o'clock in the morning. See you then. 11 a.m.? Bro's throwing a birthday party at before pre-noon? Who the hell is going to that? Can we switch videos? Nah, I'm vibing with this. It's it's bad, but it's a good it's a good bad. It's not too bad that it's unwatchable. So, what's the food like here? We didn't have this at my old school. Oh, it's great if you like pizza. You didn't have a fucking lunch. You didn't have a lunch table. You didn't have a lunch line at your fucking school. You had no goddamn cafeteria. What the f where, where the fuck did you go to school? Prison? This isn't burgers. <laughs> oh, guess who it is. Ha, <laughs> does that tray come with training wheels? Ha <laughs> ha, good one. Leave us alone, Hunter. We're carbo-loading for the SAT. SAT? Do you let kids take the SAT now? I bet he can't even spell SAT. Bro, I took the, yo, what age should you take the SAT? Like 16 to 18. You usually take your SAT junior, like sophomore through senior year. The first time I took my SAT, 
Not a PSAT, not the one that you're required to take. When I took the SAT, God, I think it was late sophomore year, which would have been what? 20, 2018 or 2019? I fucking sat down and no joke, a fucking I, chat, I'm not even lying. A 10 year old walked into the room. A 10 year old. And I was like sitting there with all the kids from my class and maybe like two other kids from like different schools because you're not required to take the SAT at your school. Uh, and so there were like two other kids that weren't from from my high school. Right. And this kid sit down, sits down and I go, what the fuck? <laughs> I go, what the fuck? And he whips out, bro, chat. He whips out like one of those calculators you'd use for cooking or in like third grade, like not a TI-84 that could do that can like map that can like map geometry, bro. He whips out like a multiplication calculator. I've never told, I don't think I've ever told this story on stream. And I remember sitting, dude, I forgot about this. I remember he sat right in front of me and I was, I the whole time I all, I, I was so distracted because I was like, this kid is going to get a fucking 500. This kid is going to get every question wrong. Why? We have, you have like a, like a little snack break in between like some of the sections. And I remember like some, one of the, one of the fucking girls asked him like, Hey, what are you doing? <laughs> like you can't, you can't just go a four hour exam without asking the 10 year old that's in fourth fucking grade. Why he's in, why he's taking a standardized test to get into college. And, and he's like, the, the kid goes, my mom wants me to take it. And like all shy. And I'm like, this kid's going to fucking fail this. Their mom is probably like hassling this kid to get like good grades. SAT. Well, at least I know what SAT stands for. Standardized academic test. Scholastic aptitude test. Oh, that's fucking stupid. What did I say? Mine's so much better. Standardized academic test. Scholastic aptitude test. What does aptitude even mean? Well, after you flunk it, you'll have to repeat junior year. Whatever. Okay, class. Today we're going to do an SAT practice test. Hey, Luke. Junior's this way so I can see your answers. Hunter. There's no point in cheating on the practice test. <laughs> You're only going to cheat yourself on the real one. Which, by the way, the actual Why do they SAT have iPads and no notebook? They don't even have a backpack. The T test is on Saturday the 15th. Mia's party is on the same day as the SAT. Fuck! Fuck! What will Andrew do? Just take the SAT another day. They have SAT days, like, once a month. What is it, Andrew? Can I take the next one? I can't do the 15th. The next one is offered in the fall, and it's only for retest or medical exemptions. Bro, that's just not true. <laughs> that's, just, that's just not true. Your school doesn't handle when the SAT is, is taken. Ever. Like, you, you go on a website and you see the dates and schools near you that are giving out the SAT at a specific day. Your school will not force you. you don't, you're not even required to take the SAT or the ACT. You could go through your entire high school fucking career and just never take a standardized test other than the PSAT. But, like, dude, what the fuck are they talking about? Like, oh, he's not allowed to skip it. Oh, man, that stinks. Mine Look did that. Mine didn't. You had to pay to take the SAT. And you just take it at whatever school is offering it on the day you want to take it. Okay, Andrew. I don't make the rules. I just follow them. <laughs> what is it, Luke? Can I do my retest now? No. A retest is only if you do poorly on the first one. Oh, I'm... Bro, just... 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 Give this kid... Give this kid a fucking minimum wage job. Please. Please. Bro, just, just uh, don't, he don't even need to finish high school. Oh, my God. Bro just said, can I take the retest now? Expel him. Definitely doing that. 
It is for standby admission purposes. And medical exemptions are only for serious illnesses. Mom, I've got a big problem at school. Really? What is it, sweetie? I've barely started and now they want me to take the SAT. Well, Andrew, to get into Dale, you have to take the SAT. This whole being a junior thing stinks. Can't I just transfer to ninth grade? Uh, that's not how that works, idiot. You're in 11th grade, you can't transfer down, buddy. Dumbass. I don't know how many times we have to go through this. You're gifted, and I'm not holding you back. Whatever. Can't I just take the SAT in the fall? Absolutely not. Next fall, you'll be starting college. Yeah. Oh, great. Now I'm skipping senior year, too. I'm not debating this with you anymore. Now go up to your room and study for the SAT. Like I need to. The SATs look easy. Now it's time to take the SAT. You have a maximum of two hours. Oh, he's not there. I'm gonna start the two hours, right? Wait a minute, where is Andrew? I don't know. <laughs> Probably chickened out. Excuse me a moment. Hello? Hi, Mrs. Walker? This is Andrew's mom. We miss Andrew. Where is he right now? He's supposed to be taking the SAT at school. Yes, I know he is, but we have a medical emergency right now. Oh my goodness, is Andrew okay? Oh yes, Andrew's fine, but my grandfather passed away. Oh, I didn't realize Andrew had a great-grandfather. Oh no, it's not my grandfather, it's Andrew's grandfather. Well, it was, until today. I certainly understand. I will put Nah, but I would never, I would never fake that shit. I feel like that's like bad. Yo, would you ever get out of something by faking your alive grandfather's death? Then that motherfucker dies the next day, and you're just gonna be like, that's my fault. Like, that's my fault. Like, I, like you could be like, oh yeah, they're sick, but it, even then, then I'd be like, dude, what if they get sick? I'm gonna feel like that's like, I put that into the universe. Andrew down for a medical- Grandpa's <laughs> taking a dirt nap. <laughs> Bro, that is the funniest phrase ever. I'm honestly gonna fucking use that now. Exemption. Yes! I mean, yes, we're making preparations right now. Oh my goodness, that's awful. I should do something for them. <laughs> that was almost too easy. Andrew, you're a genius. Okay, students, back to the SAT. Your two hours start right now. Dude, they're not even looking at any question sheet they're just looking at an answer sheet <laughs> they're just looking at a bunch of a b c d bubbles andrew where are you going uh to take the sat the sat with a gift bag well yeah they don't allow backpacks you know okay but you better not be pulling any funny business of course not, Mom. You know me. <laughs> oh, God, this video is so bad. Well, birthdays probably aren't cool anymore. Yeah, high schoolers are so artificial. Well, maybe it is for you juniors. I'm still a freshman at heart. What are they eating? <laughs> ah, I see the party started without me. <laughs> Jimmy, I'm glad you finished. Hey, buddy, I need you to do something for me. Yo, why didn't this motherfucker just take the SAT and show up afterwards? What? Uh, what? That guy was taking the SAT. Why didn't he just fucking? Why didn't he just fucking take the SAT and go and go after? Hello. Hi, this is Jimmy. I mean, Doctor James Smith, calling from the school. Oh, Doctor Smith, is Andrew all right? Yes, Andrew's fine. His teacher got, uh, sick during the SAT. Oh my goodness, is she okay? 
Well, we certainly hope so, but we had to cancel the SAT today. Oh, okay. Well, I, I understand. I'll come right over and pick him up. Oh. Uh, no, 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 no. Don't go to school. D don't do that. Really? Why not? Bro, I feel like any parent would immediately realize that this is just some fucking dude deepening his voice. Because we need to keep all the students here and test them, but not the SAT. Okay, I understand. Should I just wait for another call? Oh, no need. I'll send him home when the party's over. Very well, then. When the party's Party. over? Andrew lied about his grandpa to the teacher. Andrew lied about his grandpa taking the good old dirt nap. Now the mom's about to be fucking... <laughs> now the mom's about to fucking break into this goddamn party and shut that bitch down. And to his mom about the SAT being canceled. Oh, no! They're not going to be able to eat their sherbet. Will they ever find out the truth? What is this 140p webcam? I wonder who that can be. It's so good to see you, Mrs. Parker. Oh. I hope you're doing okay. I'm doing fine. What can I do for you? I'm so sorry to- I heard about your- I heard about your father taking a dirt nap. I'm sorry. I'm sorry to see. Hear about I'm sorry to hear that. And was grandfather passing. What? Who told you that? You did. We had a phone call about it yesterday. I called you. Give me a minute. Yo, this acting is brutal. She she is not she's not doing a good job right now, in all honesty. I don't know how much they paid her, but I'm not I'm assuming it's not that much. Hey Andrew, do you have something you want to say to your teacher? Oh hi, Mrs. Walker. That's not what I'm talking about. Andrew, did you call me yesterday pretending to be your mother? Well, it depends on what you mean by call. Did Andrew's grandfather pass away? No. And yo, how much do you think they paid her? No. Yes. Which one of the two of you is right? I have something to show you. Papa! $500. Less. 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 I'm gonna go 250 250 and she can share this video as a part of her portfolio. I think he got a McChicken. I think he got a... Yeah, my chat said my chatter said a McChicken. I think the grandpa got a McChicken. I think they paid him in uh, chocolate doubloons, a bag of M and M's. What is it, sweetheart? Your grandfather's not gone. Andrew, you lied. No, I'm not lying. My grandpa is gone. Are you talking about Grandpa Anderson? That's right. He, he died away. like six years ago. <laughs> Way four years ago. That's no reason to get out of the SAT. You skipped the SAT? I had a medical exemption. Grandpa Anderson. Bro, if you're this keen on missing the SAT, go to the SAT, shit yourself right in front of the teacher, and then walk out, and then you're fucking scot-free, buddy. You're welcome. Thank you. I will be taking care of this. All right, then. What's this all about, honey? Oh my God, that's that grandson guy. of yours is skipping school. Don't you think you're being a little? She's the grandma, bro. They look like twenty years apart. Too hard on him. When I was his age, nobody helped me out. Nobody gave me a ride. I had to walk uphill both ways to school. Things are different now. <laughs> uphill both ways. Kids have a lot of responsibilities other than school. All Look right, all right, Grandpa. Go take your dirt nap. Brenda, I think we're being a little too hard on him. I agree. I know you have your expectations, and I don't want to let you down. On second thought, let a kid be a kid. Let what is his change of heart so fast for? Dude, in the first three minutes of the fucking goddamn video, he was like, uh, I'm not paying for it unless he graduates four years Them early. enjoy high school. Really? If that's what you think. But Andrew, lying is no way to get what you want in life. I'm sorry, Grandpa. I'll never lie again. I'm still gonna ground you. 
gulp. What is this fucking Disney moving for fucking fourth wall break ending? I'm still going to ground you. How am I ever going to make the Sherbert birthday bash? What fucking dude, what high schooler is having a Sherbert birthday party? All right, next video. This is